Hey guys, now I'm back with another video on Roblox tutorials, but this one, uh, actually it's my first Roblox scripting tutorial that I'll be making. Today I'll be showing you guys how to make uh, RGB bricks, which um, change colors so you guys know what RGB means. So I just choose a base color and it's gonna be really red. First you ins insert a, a part like I did and choose the base color and insert the script in the part. So now we want to make a variable and the variable is gonna be RGB wait RGB brick so you need to make an equal and before you get to the workspace we we'll always need to write game then dot workspace then dot wait there's more than one part so let's just name this RGB And now, uh, so I'll show you what it does. So as you guys can see, uh, RGB brick. So you guys can see that. Then we make dot, so we can go to the property, property properties of uh, the part. And there's a lot of them. So I want to choose a color. And before that, we must insert the. Uh, uh, wait, how do we call it? Oh yeah, the while loop. And what what is the while loop? You ask me. Well, it's a loop. So we write while to do, and then drop a line. Wait, just remove this. First, put it in here. Then, oops. I do break a uh, dot break color. Okay. Dot. So it's break color equal break color dot new. Okay, so it's not right. Sorry, the B always make uh, always put capital B and C for the color. And if we try to write, wait, try this again. The color dot U. Okay, okay. Let's just open this parentheses and then quotation marks. I think that's what they're called. So this, uh, the brick color is a string value, and we want to change that. So let's look in the colors. So I think I'm actually going to change this from brick color to color, so we can choose any color we want from uh, the, the palette, which is this. For the color, wait, is there anything else? So equal break break RGB break dot break colors equal color three dot from RGB. So exactly what this does is this is RGB. Uh, so we need to insert numbers inside of this. And I'm gonna insert uh, the number of the really red, so comma zero, comma zero. So that's the color, of, uh, the the color of the red brick. 
And now let's do this again. So weight 0 0.1. And you just copy this, paste it, code, and now let's just try it out. <clears throat> So, as you guys can see, it's really working well. Now, we're going back to the script to finish it. So there's not really much left to do. Now we just need to sub subtract the blue part. And I'm going to fast forward it again. Let's add another script. Wait, no, uh, I'm. So let's just add a point light, but it's not necessary, so we're going to do the same thing. So since I don't want to do all of this over again, well, I really timed that perfectly. Let's put this at 5, so it's hard to notice that I failed a little. Then let's then catch on the next video, which will be how to make a fading and reappearing brick. And this is me saying, thanks for watching my video, subscribe for more uh, scripting content. And see you uh, in the next video.